it's showtime. All right, so hi, everybody. It's peaceful cabin. Mm, yeah, there's a few I didn't use. There's a few on blocks I didn't use either. And this one, I'm going to tell you right off the bat, I, I don't get this one. Like, I thought this was just going to be an embossed, an embossed one. But where's my, oh, I might have thrown it out. Uh, yeah, I might have thrown it out. It was sitting here all day, too. But it just does the holes. And I don't think it lines up. Pardon that. I don't think it really totally, like, lines up with this. It might. I mean, it might. I guess maybe it does. You know what? I'm going to run it through and see. Let's see. But like the little holes are shaped different and uh, like, I don't know. Maybe I just don't like that look. All right, let's see what we got. Yeah, like, like, what's the purpose of that? If you know, you tell me. Huh? Okay, I'm going to set that aside. I mean, from far away, it looks all right, but that's just kind of weird to me. Okay. So that was the only thing I was like, yeah. All right, go back in there. So let's put this aside. Okay, so if you're here now, you're going to get my funny story. may not be funny to some people, but to me it was really funny. So I went to the bathroom before, and when I pulled my shorts down, <laughs> I looked and I had them on backwards. <laughs> all day it's not like i hadn't gone to the bathroom before I, like it was weird i'm so glad that i never went out today because like yeah i would have been with my shorts on backwards <laughs> people would have been laughing and i wouldn't have gotten it oh too funny okay i mean it was funny to me okay so first card <laughs> is let's use the DSP. So this makes like for very easy cards. Look, I put a card in the inside. So the silver foil and I cut circle out of that and one out of white. And all my measurements will be, I mean, they're on there now. You can even look, but they'll be there for later. Um, that's the inside, Gail. This goes here. Okay, so very simple. Where's my glue? I was too busy laughing. <laughs> oh, goodness. I mean, it was bad enough when I went to Sue's house without a bra. Can you imagine that? When we get halfway there, Bob goes over a bump, and I went, <gasps> oops. Oops. All right, let's stamp this one and we'll use Hi Sean and Deborah, Carol Ann, who else? Leslie, Alice. Are you going to go like bouncing by today, Alice? Yesterday was her birthday. Everybody wish her a happy birthday. She's 29. Ah, oh, that was good. Don't smudge it, Gail. Twenty nine, and I'm twelve.
All right, so then I have this. I think this is retired, but I like it. Black and silver. And this time I'm going to put it over to that side. So just put a little tape to secure it. And then I'm going to tie one of my not so great bows while I'm live. Um, wait, somebody's asking me if I'm going live. I am live on YouTube. YouTube. Okay. That's pretty cool that I can do that not using a phone. But I won't keep doing that. That was somebody special. Don't keep, like, don't, don't keep texting me. Because I'm not answering anymore. Come on. I have to start keeping this upside down now that it's getting a little lower. No working fingers today. Am I the right direction? Yes, ma'am. Now, we don't care if that's not straight. We don't care. It is pretty paper, isn't it? There's one other card I made with the paper. It makes for such easy, easy cards. I mean, you can pump a lot of these out. Oops, I wanted that on this side this time. All right, so then the bow. It's going to go there. All right, Gail, you can do this. You can do it. Oh, but everybody's looking. I don't know if I can. See, I don't know if I can. Get in there. In. In. Out. No, first you got to go in. Stop hiding back there on my finger. Come on. Did I get it? Whew. Okay, so now we can adjust it a little bit. Even have it going straight. It's amazing. So, I didn't put any on there, but I think we can. I'll use some of these. Um, one there. One there. And one down here. And voila. See, I tied this one better than the other one. I'm going to have to redo that one. Okay. One card down. Okay. So if you remember Paper Pumpkin, and I was going to do these all the same that I did them. i got to move my coffee. Before there's a terrible accident. And we know how my accidents are. All right. So, let's move all this out of the way. We need that. And get this. So, yeah, so I never finished 
these, so I have a couple of them. So now I probably have just one left. So I'm just going to hack this off. Get rid of that. Like this can be used for some other background. But I was moving things around and I went, oh, that's like perfect for this. All right, so I'm going to cut off that edge. I probably have to do more on each side. Cut off. I have to go almost, almost to that circle. Do a little at a time because I'm scared. But I don't want to hit the circle. Oh, I think I could do more on that side. Oh, not that much more. Yeah, do we got it? I could have done a little more on the other side. All right, so then I'm going to go off the top. And then a bunch off the bottom so that it's five inches. All this goes in the garage. And then I'm going to just pop that up slightly and that up slightly. I don't want the circle to come out like last time. All right, so when you stamp this on a piece of paper, and then you run it through. So you're putting this piece, whoops, there's a tree, onto it. And then all of that is going to fall away. Depending on, you know, the, the piece, sometimes you have to cut a little bit or where you stamp the, the cabin. But I'm going to take this. And I'm going to cut that. And the only reason I decided I can fussy cut it is because this is really fast. Fast cutting. Oh, it's on the floor. Come on. So then this can slide right into there like that. So I think I'm not even going to put the glue on it now. I'm not. So you won't even have to, um, like, tape this back down. Yeah, I should have. I'll fix it. Because that circle is going to be taped to the paper, so it's not going to even do anything. Oh, oh, it's good. And then I was going to put like a, the fence there, but I just kind of liked it like that. You could add shading, but not necessary. And then I took Season's Greetings, and that came from, um, not Arctic Bears. Oh, that came from Merriest Moments, that one. And that is going to be in Evening Evergreen. Oh, 
hope that's not messy because I got ink all over. And then I'm just going to go snip, snip. And then I did this the lazy way. But it works. And that goes right there. Straight? It's hard to tell. So now you could reproduce this really easy by cutting yourself out a circle. You can even go a little bit, you know, smaller. Sponge or brush your background or use some other printed. Oh, some of the paper that comes with this. Oh, this would look pretty. Like this is the top that I didn't use of another one. So if you put that circle onto that, and then did your, you know, cut a couple trees from here and just mount it regular. You can recreate the same thing quick and easy. There's a few other pieces that come with that that would be really, really pretty as the background. All right, so that's card number two. Oh, we could put a few little pretties on this too. I don't know why I didn't pretty anything up. Just ribbon tonight. I mean, really. Oops. Let's put one there. One there. Oh, and even that little fox you could stamp there. But I'm leaving this one more to the plain side. Because maybe some people don't like foxes. I'll put it here. Oh, could have put them in the trees too. Coulda, woulda, shoulda. Or shoulda, woulda, coulda. Okay. So this is the other piece of the paper. DSP. It also had, I think I have it right here had it right there. Oh, I still have it. Let's see. Which one is it? It's that one. It's, no, it's this one. <laughs> so that was cut from there. And that was to the side of it. That was from that other one I just did. So again, simple card. You have two sheets of it, and it's in because I just ordered it. I tried this morning. They still didn't have it um, a few minutes ago. They had it because I have more sets to make. A bunch are going out in the mail tomorrow. Oh, no, that wasn't this one that I ordered. This one's fine. Never mind. It was the other one from my... Oh, I confused myself. There's another laugh for you. Does she even know what she's talking about? Not always. But two sheets of each, so you can get plenty of cards. Easy cards. So this is for the inside. This is basic gray. Maybe I'll stamp the little fox here on the inside. Did I do anything on this one? Nope. Uh, nope. 
Okay, and this can even go down. I feel like my camera's really low tonight. What'd you get? A bump inside? <sighs> get up there. Get up. Get, get, get. Ah. No, still not. Could be me. All right, so then that's going to go right there. And that's just stamped in gray, basic gray. Smoky slate is a little bit too light. I love this glue that it doesn't get sticky. All right, then... And stamp fence there and then in the black black I'm going to stamp thank you because you do need winter thank you cards so I'm going to put that right there I hope it's straight straight yes and then a little bit more bling come on come on come on little doggy one and a two This one I could have done the fox, but I have the fox on another one. And I want that little piece to go down. Yeah, I got some. Wasn't sure if I got it. So there is, oh, let me do something on the inside. Do the fox or a tree? Do the fox. Do the fox. Mm, 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 mm. Do the fox. Do a couple of them. Everything comes in threes, right? There's our little winter fox. Ta-da! Alrighty then. Then we've got this one. So for this one, I brought out Arctic Bears and did that bear again. So let me show you. Stamp the trees, and where's that piece? Oh, that's gone too. All right, so I'm just going to do it and show you. I just won't cut them out because they're already cut out. So I can stamp one over here. Let's see, can't fit it there. But then you can turn it around and get another one out of there. On oh, stamp, it's so good. That's okay. All right, so I'm going to need that. So before I put it together, you know what? Let's get this over with. So I cut these out of the DSP. So I have some of those 
and then I have some of these but they're basically the same color so they're going to look the same so what I did is ink up the trees and then lay a bunch of these down We'll do one of the plain ones there. Let's see if two fit. Kind of, sort of. Then, if you're smart, you take some kind of piece of paper and go over it. You still have ink on your fingers from laying them down. But then, can you see it? you've got texture and it looks more like a tree oh that was the back side of it let's do some more on that one it didn't get rubbed good all right my fingers are gonna be yucky Put a Band-Aid on your finger and then you don't have to worry about it. Yes, texture. I like it. That's the bad one. That one on the back. Oh, but stupid me. The back is empty, but I could fix the front now. Ta-da! Okay. Let's put this to the side. I'm going to put it face down because I think I have enough ink on my fingers. Somewhere is my rag. That eh, tissue will work. Okay. Let's put it together. Let's get rid of that. Well, we're not, we're going to do something else first. Let's put all these pieces here and here. All right, so I'm going to take Misty Moonlight. Oh, I better have my rag so I can clean the mess. Sometimes my dog takes them into the living room because they fall on the floor. Um, yeah, here. So this is the Misty Moonlight first. And if you want to give it more of a night appear appearance, you know, go around the top and then leave your, your center. Then we're going to take the lighter one and start where it's dark and bring it up and around. And I never worry about making my, I, I know I say it all the time, but if there's anybody new, I don't try to make my skies or my, like when I do water, I don't try to make that like smooth because... This gives you the effect of like clouds and reality. Okay, so I'm going to clean that. A little alcohol. Is this water or alcohol? Alcohol. I was moving things, so I lost this a long time ago. And then made a new one for myself. Just making sure it was the alcohol. Okay. So we can go ahead and no, we're not going to do that. We're going to glue this first. So you're going to figure out which one. And of course, it's the one I left that's a little thicker. 
So we're going to put glue on this here. I got it. <laughs> it was a little dried booger. Glue booger. So, so one of them you're going to lose, but that's okay, because we knew we were going to lose it. And once you have that, so your back is going to look like that, a little crooked, but that's your back, so you don't care. And then you want to see where you want them on here. Why are you crooked? They're like angled. All right, so we're going to cut that overage off. And then we're going to come in with a few of these to fill in. Let's put that one there. If you really want to get fancy, I didn't, is, you know, you can make some shading under there. Put that one over there. And I want a medium size one. Oh, you're the one that I kind of damaged. Kind of sort. Oh, those are plain. Well, we're going to use the damaged one. So that gives you the impression that they're back. And let's close this up. Yeah, when I cut that, I had no clue that there were, there was embossing. But it was in with my scrap, so it must have been uh, one I didn't like the way part of it came out or something. All right. So all we have to do is stamp the hello friend after I just put that ink away. Oh, so this came from the one I used the other night, Biggest Wish. Love that set. Like, everybody should own that set. Because you could either do the big letters or these. So, I mean, this could be also, you know, Christmas card. Season's greetings. But sometimes you need these different cards. Okay, so now we're going to put this on to the evergreen. Evening, evergreen. How did I know? Should have known. I'm just going to 
flip that. Drop a glue there. And I may make a background, you know, like shading after all. Nope, it's coming off. I may do it anyway. Let's see. I'm going to do it with a, a green one. <laughs> Let's see how that looks. Yeah, it just has to be going to dry a little lighter. So it's not a lot. It's just something. See? It's almost going away because you see it close up, but it's there. But it's getting lighter. And and I don't think I'm going to do anything more to this one. Unless, <laughs> unless these go with the last card, maybe, maybe one of those, a couple of those will look good. Let's see. Like maybe like the silver ones, right? You got them, you got to use them. Turn over. Oh, I win. And come on, another silver. No? Yes? Oh, it flipped back. I lose. It'll work. Stay. 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 Oh, I think I lost some of that. I really use my other one more. I use this for things. I think I got some of that green stuff right on there. Whatever, I'll get it off after. Uh, I'm just not going to worry about it. <laughs> yeah. All right, so there's card number four and one mole. This one. Okay, so oh, I saved one. See, this is how it'll look. And then you just snip that off. Did I just get that ink on there? Oh, it doesn't matter because it's going in the back. That's going to go there. Okay, we got this. So this one is going to be brushed. Did I drop it on the floor before? I think I did. Yep. Thought I was done with it. <laughs> All right, so we're going to do a quick sky with balmy blue. Balmy. How I love you, how I love you, my dear old Bobby. Uh, 
I went there today and found the prettiest Christmas paper. Yay! She's got them ready to go. I think you're ready for a refill too. I almost sprayed it in my face. How to end the evening. Pants on backwards and hmm, spray yourself in the face. Okay, so we're going to mount this. We're not going to mount that. Yeah, I could do that. No, I can't. Yes, I can. No, I can't. Let's do this first. All right, so I'm going to put some glue on the back piece. And part of it is going to get cut off. This one is measured exactly to the piece of card stock that I just sponged. Let's bring that over more. Okay. Here I'm going to put in a second a couple dimensionals. All right. So that goes off. Lost my dimensionals again. Oh, there they are. Ooh, green. So now this one. Oh no, Gail, I knew that didn't look right. I was like, what am I doing? Okay, now we're going to take that fence. Now you're not the fence. Ah, oh, it's right here. I think too. Let's see how much I can get off. Just a little bit. It's quite a lot of it. See? Okay. So the fence in, where is it? My soft suede. That's balmy blue. All right, I lost the soft suede. Aha, uh -huh. I covered it up. So I'm going to do one there, one there, then I'm going to take, I think I'm done with that, I'm going to take Misty Moonlight, 
and that season's greeting that I have to clean the green off. Of course, I have my other cleaning thing right over there, but this will work good enough. It's just one more thing to get in my way. Season's greetings right there. Yes! I like it. See, now I had another thought with this card, but let me see what time it is. 8.46. I could experiment and do it. I could do it, although I should have done it before I mounted it on here. All right, so I'm going to take some white ink, kind of like what I did a couple videos ago. Oh, that's a big, big, big ink. I'll use that one. So I'm going to take some white ink. I'm going to take some. Oi. Wink of Stella. It would help if I put it where you got. Whoa. I'm going to take, look at that sparkling, some basic gray. Then I'm going to mix it all together. I really want it to be more sparkly, though. So, it's going to be sparkly, all right. All right, let's see how we did. I'm actually just going to stamp it into there. We'll see if it comes out sparkly where I can see it. You know, sometimes these experiments work and sometimes they don't. Let's see how just for the heck of it it looks. Ooh. I like how it looks on the snow. All right, so it's a little sparkly. I'd still like it to be a little bit more. So I think I'd have to use my other sparkle stuff. But that was fun. Different. All right. Oh, I still got to stamp the little guy. I lost him. There he is. Oh, on one of them I did birds. I wonder which one it was. I don't know. 
I don't have another one left. Huh? I wouldn't want to be walking outside. Those little foxes. Oh, and the other thing I did is I took a very, very light, um, like a brownish gray, and kind of made a walkway. Just to give it a little bit more texture, and then a little bit of shadow. They could have a little shadow, little guys, and mount that onto the card. And then we're done. But before I do that, because I know I'm going to forget, clean that off, and then. Always upside down. <laughs> or backwards. <laughs> oh, I'm not going to let myself live that down. I'm so glad I didn't go outside today. So glad. All right. So let me just move some of this out of the way. And I'll bring those cards back. Look, I brought out my sticky mat for my stamp pad and didn't even use it. All right. Away with you. Away. Up, up, and away. Oh, my vape was out there the whole time. Okay, so we got that one. We got that one. Did I? Oh, yeah, I did put stuff on that one. Where's that stuff again? See? Thought I was done? Thought you were rid of me? Ha! Ha! Nah. I'm so sorry I cleaned up. Oh, here we go. So now I want these whitish ones. Upside down. There you go. And because if I don't do it now, you know what's going to happen. Anybody else like that? That's silver. We want the whitish. Look, they're just about perfect. Of course, it's covered up so much for that. I do like the way the little specks look. Now that they're drier. Because the gray was in there, you can actually, you know, kind of see them. More texture. Get down. Get down, get down. One more. All right, now you guys can be done with me. After I get the rest out and cover this back up, wipe it off. All right, so that one, this one, that one. Oops, lift that up. Man, for moving everything around here, things are like too close, too far, too something. Oh, and I got a really nice card in the mail. Where's the other one I did? That one. This is from Sean. Yes, our very own Sean sent me a hello card. So pretty. Our very own Sean. All right, so there's 
tonight's mess of cards. Yay! Oops. Yay! So thanks, everybody, for being here. <laughs> oh, Ink with Heather. Gina, thank you, Gina. Barbara, Mary. Who else I miss? Karen. And there's probably people like way up above. But thanks, everybody, for being here. And I will see you again on Sunday with, you know my motto, I don't know what. But it'll be something. See y'all then. Good night.